workers. Like many businesses, small and large, Indiana is trying to hire and retain more workers. So the state is rolling out sweeping changes to its workplace policies, something it hasn't done in decades. The plan is called the Next Level State Work Agenda. The first phase rolled out this month and includes a flexible hybrid schedule. Employees can work from home for two days. Phase one also includes an updated education reimbursement policy, which allows workers to collect more than $5,200 a year. Employees can also receive money for referring new hires. The state also plans to bring back retirees to work in tailor-made positions. Some of our most knowledgeable people that have worked in state government for decades. We have a vast network of retirees and we understand that in the pandemic, retirees are interested in coming back to work, even maybe not in a full-time role. The state will also give workers extra time for community service leave so they can do more charity work. That's the first phase of three phases that make up the next level state work agenda. Phase two rolls out in May. It deals with helping employees with child care and dependent care. We'll also see the governor's public service achievement awards recognizing exceptional work. Phase three in July will reassess the pay scale and could lead to higher wages across the board. The state has more than 1,040 open jobs. If you're interested, we provide provided a link to the Work for Indiana website at HiringHoosiers.com.